What's up guys, Kyle here with Crypto Theory. All right, we are jumping right in today to NFTs, the wonderful world of NFTs, okay? We've had a lot of people wanting us to talk about uh, some more NFTs. They are the hottest thing going in crypto and we're coming back with another video about WAX, okay? It's been a while since we talked about this project right here and I wanna kind of give an update because this is one of the top projects in the space. Uh, you know, it depends on who you ask. Some people may not think so and that's okay. However, it's been around a long time. It's got a lot of, it's, it's got a lot Lot of uh, you know history behind it and everything so I want to talk about it and let people know what this ultimately is so that's what we're gonna be talking about but before we do that guys make sure to smash up that like button if you like crypto if you like NFTs if you like wax smash up that like button let YouTube know that get more people out there listening in on uh, our videos and just on cryptocurrency in general okay the more people that have more knowledge the better it is for everybody okay Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on those notifications. We're getting so close to 2,500 subs, and as soon as we do get 2,500 subscribers, we are doing an Amazon gift card giveaway to a couple lucky winners, okay? And the only thing you have to do to enter for that is to be a subscriber. And then last but not least, before we jump in and start talking wax, guys, make sure to like us on Facebook. I'll get that pulled up for you. So here we go. Make sure to like us on Facebook. It's right under Crypto Theory. Remember, we have rebranded. We are no longer no tie required. We are going straight crypto. So it is Crypto Theory. And then also we have our own crypto group that we have just started, Tales from the Crypto. All sorts of stuff is going to be posted in there. Uh, we have all sorts of great discussions going on. It, it's a great community and we're going to continue to keep building it and keep getting it bigger. So guys, make sure to join those if you want to stay up to date on everything cryptocurrency related. Okay. So let's jump right into it. Let's talk wax. Okay. So as you can see right now, you know, it, it's interesting because the rest of the market absolutely booming today. Okay. Wax sitting here at 25 cents, the rest of the market and, and guys bear in mind, this is being filmed the night before this actually comes out. Okay. So uh, just, just be aware that this is being filmed Thursday night to come out on Friday. So prices may vary a little bit, you know, who knows? Um, hopefully at the, hopefully at that point, the prices are uh, on the uptick for everybody. Uh, you know, we'll see. But as of right now, sitting at 25, 25 and a half, we'll call it 26 cents, uh, and number 171 in terms of overall market cap, okay? Uh, market cap of 399 million, basically we're going to say 500 or uh, 400 million uh, because we're getting so close to it. Trading volume, almost 8 million. Not a super high trading volume. It's obviously not the worst, but it's not a super high trading volume compared to some of the other ones that we've been talking about recently. But, um, you know, it is what it is. As we go down through here, here's the interesting thing because, guys, the rest of the market is absolutely scorching hot right now. Okay, the last few days have been incredibly bullish. A lot of great news coming out. Obviously, Coinbase having their IPO on Wednesday was a huge, huge, uh, you know, kick in the right direction for for crypto in general. But all the coins that are on uh, Coinbase uh, are getting pretty good pumps right now. Wax is not on Coinbase, so obviously that's not getting the benefit of that. But compared to the rest of the market, like I said, I mean, look at. Over the last 30 days, down 7.5%. Over the last uh, two weeks, down 30%. So if ever you were going to get into this project, now wouldn't be a bad time. Again, not professional financial advice. This isn't us saying that you should do this. This is just us saying, hey, you know our motto, buy the dip, okay? You know, buy when it's in the red, sell when it's in the green, and you're making good gains. This would be, a, you know, maybe a pretty decent entry point. Not professional advice, just you know, just kind of putting our thoughts out there. Now, here's the really exciting thing about this project, and we're going to jump in and talk about what it actually is, but I kind of want to talk about right now where it is right now from a pricing standpoint, like we said, about 25, 26 cents. Look where it's been, and I know this was during, you know, this was during their ICO, which, you know, a lot of coins get pumps, you know, huge pumps during that, but I mean, literally two and a half to three bucks somewhere in there, about 270 it looks like. And even at another all time, or another high, uh, you know, in there, there's a couple of spots, like a dollar fifty. I mean, so this thing has a ton of room to run just to get back to its previous highs, whether you want to go with the all time high way up here, or if you want to even go with some of these other ones that are kind of in the middle, there's a spot right there. I was going to say like a dollar fifty, dollar sixty. So this thing has a lot of room to run, and we're going to talk at the very end. If you stick around to the end, we're going to talk price prediction. First, I want to kind of bring everybody up to speed on what Wax actually is, what it does, and then we'll come back and we'll give a final price prediction at the very end and show you where you can pick this up at. So let's go to Wax's website. All right, perfect. So as you can see, they dub themselves the king of NFTs. Okay, WAX is actually uh, an acronym for Worldwide Asset Exchange. Okay, so they're basically saying it's the world's leading decentralized video game and entertainment network. They deliver the safest and most convenient way to create, buy, sell, and trade 
uh, NFTs, virtual items, to anyone anywhere in the world. Okay, really, really interesting stuff. And obviously, guys, you can you know this is just the Cliff Notes version of it. That's what we bring you. We want to give you the the straight facts on it. You guys can come in and do your own research uh, to really you know decide do I want to invest in it. We're just trying to give you guys kind of a brief synopsis. You know the crypto Cliff Notes, if you will. Um, so anyway, as you can see right here, uh, basically they're marrying the explosive growth of NFTs. Which I mean, guys, if you haven't seen nfts are massive okay there's uh, there's been one that sold for 69 million dollars for crying out loud i mean absolutely crazy uh with the superior uh, monetization capabilities of d5 okay so uh, again as you can see uh they basically dubbed themselves the king of nfts global brands are trusting wax to launch their nft sales including uh, atari tops william shatner capcom and more okay so a lot of partnerships a lot of companies utilizing wax to be able to mint uh uh, or not mint, but launch their NFT sales, okay? Also, right here, build dApps, games, marketplaces, and more on Wax, okay? So their developer hive is offering documentation, quick starts, and code samples uh, to help developers build things at a quicker pace to get them out there to the masses, okay? A lot of great stuff. I mean, I'm not going to go through every single thing on here, but you guys can see not only are they helping people launch products, uh, launch NFTs, um, but they're helping them build them too, okay? Really, really cool project right here, and, and it's one of the best spaces to be in right now. I mean, NFTs, gaming, all that type of stuff goes hand in hand, and it is literally the hottest thing going right now. And then they marry it with the other hottest thing, DeFi, uh, that there is. And, I mean, to me, that just spells home run, or at least I think it, I think it will. So if we go back out here, ultimately, guys, where do I think that this is going to end up at? Let's take a look real quick at the markets where you can pick this up if you're interested. And then we're going to give a, you know, we're going to throw out some, some pricing ideas. All right. So you can see right here, it's got all the different volume up. It obviously uh, looks like carrying the weight of the, the volume for the trading volume for WAX. Um, uh, Huobi, Bittrex, HitBTC, KuCoin. I mean, lots of different exchanges on there. You'll notice no Binance, no Coinbase, okay? So this one, not the easiest one to get. However, it's also not something that's super hard. Now, if this was to be on Binance, uh, for instance, um, you know, you would see a big price increase. The liquidity of it's going to be much easier. So many people utilize Binance. Uh, it would make it a lot more accessible for people. So I think that's one of the things that ultimately holds it back just a little bit because it is, you know, it is a great platform for NFTs. Um, and, you know, with that being said, ultimately, where do I think that this is going to end up from a uh, from a pricing standpoint? Well, you could see a lot of different scenarios playing out here. I mean, it could be something where, hey, maybe maybe it only gets back to its previous all-time high. At that point, you're still looking about a 10x, roughly, maybe even a little bit more from where it's at right now. I mean, those are still some pretty healthy gains right there. Let's say that it only gets back to one of these ones right here in the middle, like this dollar fifty-seven or dollar sixty, whatever it was right there. Again, you're still looking at some huge gains compared to where it's at right now. So to me, I only see upside for this. Not again, not professional advice, but I only see upside for this project. Now, if we want to put our conspiracy uh, theory hats on and say that this thing absolutely moonshots, which again, it's crypto, guys. Anything could happen. Who knows? Um, if we put our conspiracy hats on and just say, you know what, we know that this thing has previously been about two dollars and seventy cents. It looks like, given you know, given this chart, and we could pull that up a little bit closer. We're just gonna we're just gonna kind of throw out a number based on where it is between the two and the three. So we're gonna say two dollars and seventy cents. Let's say it goes double its previous all-time high, which a lot of projects are doing well over that. I mean, most projects right now are hitting their uh, uh, previous all-time highs and creating new ones. Bitcoin and Ethereum both did today. Um, you know, what if this thing was to go to like five bucks? I mean, again, if you're into it right now, I mean, you are looking at some seriously significant gains on that. So it's all speculation. Where do I ultimately think that it's going to end up? To me, I believe it'll end up somewhere between that 250 and $3 mark. It might be higher than that, but I think it at least gets back to its previous all-time high personally. If it goes past that, I'm 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 gonna be super stoked about that, but I would absolutely be happy uh, with this right here. I think that this is a great project. I think, look, at the end of the day, is it the king of NFTs? That's up for debate because there's a lot of great projects in the NFT space. But the big thing to note is I think that it's important uh, to have some sort of NFT projects in your portfolio if you have the available funds to do that. They are the hottest thing going. A lot of them are going to see big pumps and everything. And I think Wax uh, could be one of them, especially at a smoking price like this right here. So uh, with that being said, guys, that's all I got. Enjoy the rest of your day. We'll catch you in the next one.